All right, we are in Ryder Square, and we're about to go tour my Ryder Square listing here. And I just wanted you to see how close it is here to the 16th Street Mall Cheesecake Factory there. And then we're just a few steps from the condo here. Uh, so you're literally right in the middle of everything as we walk to the Ryder Square condo and and let's, uh, let's go take a look all right see you I will see you up at the condo. All right, let's go take a look at the inside of this Ryder Square condo, unit 39, on the fourth floor. Um, as you walk in here, I'm gonna just take off my shoes real quick. Um, you have these really gorgeous hand-scraped hardwood floors. And then we have granite countertops, stainless steel appliances, just, a completely open, modern floor plan and flow and finishes. It's very light and bright. We have all these, uh, we have two slide, three sliders from this space alone out to the balcony. Um, a huge dining space. You could probably seat 10 to 12 here um, comfortably without it feeling cramped. Um, we have views of the Pepsi Center and the mountains out of this window. And then, um, so in, in, in the kitchen, we go back to the stainless steel appliances, um, just gorgeous cabinets, very well lit. Um, you know, so just, you know, I think it suits most people's taste. And then we have a gas fireplace here with a stone um, finish. And then as you walk out here, we have this large patio overlooking the courtyard. So you can look down, scroll the video down, and see the courtyard. You can see the Tower of Eliches there in the distance and Acme in the distance over there. And then walking... Um, I may go towards the master suite first, and then we'll look at this office space as well. Um, but I kind of want to look at the look at the bedrooms first. Here to the left, we have our laundry area and our spare bathroom. So nice finishes, tile around the tub, and then a modern vanity. And then the master suite is awesome. It's absolutely gigantic. Double vanity here, and then a really awesome walk-in closet with a custom closet organization system here. And then um, to the left here, we have a five-piece bath with a tub and a walk-in shower with a seamless glass and poured pan. Really nice finishes all around the tub, pristine and clean. Um, really nice. I love the different insets on the ceiling. So it definitely goes up and, you know, um, I mean, at points it feels like it might be as high as 10 feet, but definitely taller than your normal. And then here's a private balcony for these two bedrooms here. So we have a private balcony here. You're looking, um, what street? we're looking towards 15th here. And then you walk through, and this is our other spare bedroom. So we have a, this is the second bedroom. Um, so sorry for the confusing wraparound. We have a nice closet space. Our utilities are here to the right. And then, um, so here's the closet. Like there was the laundry to the left. There was the master bedroom. Here's the bedroom we just came out of. So sorry for looping around and making it confusing. And then we have the office, but it's also our third bedroom because we do have a full closet. And it opens up with glass French doors to the living space. So really perfectly versatile space here. And it also 
has a slider back to this patio. So you have four sliding glass doors that go to this patio. So that concludes the tour of the inside of this unit. I don't know if I'm going to be successful on merging a, a video of the Ryder Square on the outside and a video of the parking, but we do have two cover garage spots that come with this unit. Thank you for watching the video. All right, we are at Plaza uh, Parking Level 1 here. So as you walk out of the elevator, um, I think we're like about maybe 40 feet to get to the parking for this unit. And it's uh, parking 69 and 70 here. And then there's the elevators over there, and they have some uh, carts stored so that you can easily get stuff up to your unit. Um, so I'm hoping I'll be able to join this parking video to the main video.